Hey y'all, what's up? I'm back. It's good seeing y'all. I hope y'all happy to see me too. So today, I decided to make my own pizza and some hot wings. So, this is the bread though that I will be using for this pizza. <laughs> And I do not own copyrights to this music. I do not own rights to this music. So today I'm gonna start off with I got my mushrooms that I'm gonna put on my pepperoni I me mean, on my pizza. So it's gonna be a pepperoni hamburger pizza. And these are the pepperonis that I be using because the deli did not have none, so I I chose to get these. So I got my green pepper my onion so i'm gonna move i got my hamburger meat that i'll be adding to my pepperoni pizza so i'm gonna move this to the side and put that right here and i also want to show y'all the wings that i'll be making so these are hot wings so i added mustard and a bunch of seasonings i added um charcoal seasoning i added uh Slap your mama seasoning. I added some garlic pepper to it, some garlic powder, I mean garlic onion. Sorry, I also added garlic powder. And um, as y'all know, I don't eat salt, so it won't be too much salt today. So yeah, so I'm just letting them marinate before I put them in the flour and fry them, and then I will put my add my sauce, make my sauce to it. So as I'm gonna move these mushrooms to the side and start cutting my green pepper. So how y'all doing today? I'm a little nervous because this is my first time. Somebody told me to cook. I should record myself cooking and making the food. So this will be my first time. Even though this I'm new to this, I'm still learning. So therefore. Actually, my homegirl Rita, Rita Gilman, Gillian, asked me to cook it, so I cook in my meal. So that's not a bad idea, as long as I can stay in one area, you know. So. And I'm just cutting them. You can cut your onion, your green peppers any kind of way you want to. If you want them thick, you can cut them thick. If you want them thin, you can cut them thin. But y'all, this is my first time really making this. So we gonna see how it go. <laughs> y'all will be my witness to it. And I don't want much green pepper because I get heartburn. So I'm gonna leave it like that and put this to the side and start on my onion. I'd rather just cut my onion. It don't matter how you cut your onions either, so. So I'm gonna just do them like this. Uh oh. And I did wash my hands before I started, y'all. So. And I, I don't mind putting a, a lot of onions on here. So, how y'all weekend going so far? I'm sweating. I went to the grocery store today. And that's about it. So, another thing, y'all, this is, uh, I'm going to use a little marinara sauce because I really don't like tomato sauce. And I got my pizza sauce, the little pizza sauce I'm going to use for it. So, y'all, as I put this to the side, if I can get everything out the way, I'm going to go ahead and put this to the side and show y'all how I'm going to do my crust. And then I got my little butter I'm going to put in the pan. You know, you got this. So, make sure my pot cleaned out, which I did anyway. You know. So, I'm going to use it in this pan. For some reason, I think it might cook better as I looked it up. You know. So, okay, let me start by going and take this out. But let me start by spraying my pan. 
Y'all, I'm new to this. I'm just doing something. I wanted pizza. And you know how sometimes you order pizza and it don't be how you want it? So, I feel like you should make it how you want it. You know? And I always pre-cook your... Go ahead and pre-cook it and stuff. Pre-cook your um, oven. You know? Yeah. You know? The struggle going to be real, so I'm going to cut that at her uh, open. Yeah, I'll listen to old music, too. That's characters in the fox <laughs> music. I chose this bread because it's not really like doughy and yeasty and stuff like that. If you don't want no doughy, yeasty bread and stuff, I recommend. I don't tried this bread before. And I take that back. I have made a piece out of it, a small one. So this is how it looks. You know the bag. So I got my cooking oil already in there. So look at that. That fit in there perfectly. So, y'all, I'm finna step to the side, and I gotta get a spoon. Sorry, I should've had everything ready. So, I got this going. Y'all gotta excuse my kitchen. It ain't junky. It ain't nasty, but it's just a little junky because I went to the grocery store. I got most of the stuff up. So... I'm going to go ahead and start with my with my pizza sauce. It's just some, you know, some local pizza sauce. It probably tastes the same as any restaurant. So, so I'm just going to take this and put it in this spoon and start it in the middle. Start it in the middle. Look at me talking like I'm a professional. I'm going to let y'all see it. Yeah. So, I'm going to go ahead and put a little more. Because I don't really like too much. But, hey. And then I'm going to spread it around. Because I'm also using marinara sauce too, y'all. So, don't forget about that. I need a little more. Also, I gotta jump in the refrigerator, y'all, and get my um my cheese that I'm putting on it. You know, you just you know, it's just your local little pizza that you this how you want it. You know, cook it how you want it. If you want to put bacon on there, put bacon on there. If you want all kind of toppings on there, put it on there. So I am gonna take a look at this. And then this is just a regular marinara sauce that I, you know, for cheese sticks or whatever. It all tastes the same, so. Hope I don't splash this on me. You know, you know how I get messy. I should have had me an apron, which I don't have now. But if this works out all right, I'll see how. And I'll get me a, um apron, some apron. Once again, I do not own rights to this music. Y'all, I just turned it on because it was too quiet. So, we got that going. So, I'm going to put the spoon to the side, put my tops back on. And, y'all, I, I do not have nothing open, really. I just... I wanted the video to be long enough for y'all. Let me step to the side and get my cheeks. So this is the cheese I'm going to be using. Mozzarella and provolone cheese. So I had to get my Italian seasoning. This is a cheap brand, y'all. You ain't got to get expensive. It all tastes the same. And I got some basil. 
that I'm gonna put on now. So yeah, this is I'ma start it. Put my cheese on here. No, just make it if you wanna eat a whole bag of cheese on now, put a whole bag of cheese on now. If you want five of different cheeses on now, put it on now. And I'ma just spread it around and you know, I like a lot of cheese, so hey, it is what it is with me, so look it up. So I try to, you know, just spread it around how you want it. This is a good little meal if you don't really just feel like cooking. It ain't it ain't a long meal. It's something quick. So next I'm gonna start by let me put this to the side, y'all. Cause I'm probably gonna have to freeze this. I mean, you can always freeze this. It's okay. You can make a half one. You ain't gotta make the whole thing. I'm just being greedy, extra. So then I'm gonna go ahead and start with my um pepperoni, which is you know the regular pepperoni. They good though. I'm tasting them, folks. So if I can open her, should add my scissors. Yeah, and another reason I didn't show me cooking the hamburger meat and all that because I did not want to do all that, changing the camera and all that, y'all. These is big jumbo pepperonis, too. And they look good. I got to eat one. Y'all, <laughs> yeah. yeah. Blaze them. You just put it if you want to put the whole pack on there, put the whole pack on there. You know? If you want two or three pepperonis on now, put the two or three pepperonis. Y'all, I don't know if I'm supposed to put the vegetables and the onions on first or what. So with me, I'm gonna put a little extra. <laughs> just a little extra. And there ain't nothing wrong with it. Yeah, it look good, too. I got to show y'all. Look, y'all. That ain't even a half. I got to put the hamburger meat on that end of it. So look at that. Ain't it 40? So, I'm going to go ahead and start. Go ahead and put my hamburger meat on that, I guess. And guess what, y'all? I got my first request of what to eat. So I asked y'all what y'all want me to eat next. So my request is from my aunt. My aunt Kathy, she wants me to eat chicken wings, I mean chicken tenders, fries, and ranch. And I love chicken tenders, fries, and ranch. So I went to the store and got some for her. Shout out to you, Kathy Harper, for the, you know, the little request. I appreciate you. So, y'all, I'm going to go ahead and put this on here. If I got to spread it around. And, you know, just spread it around. Uh-oh. So. If you want every bite to have a piece of hamburger meat in now, let everybody have a piece of hamburger in here. So, y'all, I'm going to show y'all this when it's done. I'm going to sit and eat with y'all and chat with y'all a little more. So, now I'm going to put my um my mushrooms on here. So, I got these good old, big old, healthy mushrooms. If you like, like, some, if you like lots of mushrooms, put a lot of mushrooms on there. Spread them out. Excuse me. Spread them out if you want to. However you want to do it. So now I'm going to go ahead and lay my uh, green peppers on here. Like I said, I don't really eat much green pepper. They good raw. 
but cook, they give me heartburn. So I'm gonna try to go light on here. Then I'm gonna go ahead and put my onions on here. Which you can make your onions any way you want to. However you want them on here, put them on there. If you want it double layer, single layer, triple layer, put them on here. But I'm a y'all know I'm an onion lover. More than anything. So I'm gonna do it like that. Got my stove on. I got my I got my air fryer on for my wings, y'all. Me not my air fryer, my deep fryer on. But the sauce that I'm just using just to make my hot wings with, I don't have Texas Peak, so I'm gonna use this Haracha. And I'ma just use this simple sauce, you know. And that's it. And I'll show y'all the after fit. But I am finna put some Italian season on here. Y'all, this mug look good and it smell good. Put that Italian on there. I got my parsley over there. I'm going to put some basil on there. A little basil. Y'all, I took my hair loose. I'll show y'all once before I start eating tonight. But y'all stay tuned. If you want to see how I made this pizza and you want to see how it came out, Keep watching. Give me the thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button, you know, and let's get it popping. Let's do this. Look at her. Look at her. Will you look at her? That's a good pizza. Yeah. Oh, I forgot, Aunt Calca. I'm going to do your request Tuesday, I mean Monday, because I'm, I already prepared my food for t Saturday and Sunday. And I'm going to show y'all what I'm eating tomorrow. And I might cook with y'all tomorrow too. But I'm going to do your chicken your chicken tenders and your ranch and your fries Monday. At your request. It'll probably, I don't know what time it'll be, but I'll do it. Love ya. Thank y'all for watching. Peace. Come back to see the end results of what how this pizza go look.